the 2023 FIH Indoor Hockey Men's World Cup Final. That is the Netherlands up against the world number one side, Austria. Before we get there, time now to stand for the national anthems. World Cup, all of it brought to you live. It's been a pleasure to work for FIH as on behalf of SABC Sports. It's been really great. And to see two great teams like this. And here come the Austrians again. And it is Kerpa! Michael Kerpa! With the finest of touches and manages to put the world champions ahead. I thought, uh, I thought on an initial play that he had accidentally underhit that. It was very, very deliberate. Cutting inside and a penalty corner given. And he'll inject this ball into the circle. Kipkins laid it across. It's getting Mirkus and blocked on the line there by Utagosha. And it is a penalty stroke. Twice, right once in that game. What can Where Max Suri do time? now? Let's see what he can do. He's up against some check and he beats him to level the scores. Referred side to the left. He missed one earlier when he went to the left. He changed to the right, but he goes back to try and test it. Chance, it really, he hasn't had much, and there's another chance. Kerpa with and the shot, and he finds the corner from an impossible angle. Michael Kerpa puts the Austrians back in the lead. This is right up there. What a player. He takes the first chance. I just said he doesn't need a second invitation. He doesn't need a big gap. He takes that. He turns it inside. Then uh, went on to beat Germany in the 2018 edition. And here's a shot on goal. And they do find it. And it comes away of Max Rehring. Burying the ball in the far corner. Perfect response when they needed it the most. And the score now. Austria 2, Netherlands 1. Ah, uh, the penalty stroke specialist finding a gap. I think it's friendly blows, nothing too malicious in it for now. And here comes Schutt with a good run, but excellent tackle. Still available, and who's there? It is Nicky Lewis to capitalize on an error at the back. First time in this final. Can they hit back immediately? And they find a way back. How about that? through from the Thornblum and at the back there a predator like goal in the right place at the right time stands over the ball he'll inject it to the top three players waiting for it oh and it almost is lobbed over the top very open play from one end to the other end fantastic skit skills and it's a penalty corner they come and they do find the direct line into the back of the goal and it is Jutrust that puts the Netherlands back in the lead again with one minute and 34 seconds remaining in this clash well the question is this time can they hold it the, again the finish is really good to see some fantastic play throughout this tournament and the goalkeepers are vital vital key in any team success it is a penalty corner. It was an unforced Into error. Kersha. Oh, he gets a stroke. Michael Kerper. Michael Kerper puts it in the back of the goal. He has a hat trick. And what a vital goal that is to bring his side back into this final. We go to a shootout to decide who will take the title of the 2023 FIH Indoor Hockey yes. World Cup. It is Austria that will go first in the shootout. Ended for all between these two nations, Austria and Netherlands. And it's come down to the shootout with Eitenberger the first to go one on one with the goalkeeper. Eitenberger is denied, not once, but twice. Eitenberger, he came in, he looked tentative. In fact, he looked a little bit nervous and he tried to back away. He didn't get the power and on the rebound, not enough. Big opportunity for Netherlands. Now it's the Netherlands captain, Boris Burgot, that goes up against Mateusz Simczyk. Burgot, Simczyk. And it's an easy put away for the Dutch skipper as 
as cool as ice, Boris Burgot gives the Netherlands the lead in the shootout. Yeah, and we see here, uh, as he goes around, he was touched. He could have gone down and have a stroke. It's great to see that he, he stayed up, and it is a goal, 1-0 to the Dutch. Here comes Unterkirche, Fabian Unterkirche, number 23, up against Joey van Valstein. You can't deny that man. He is a, such a playmaker. Fabian Unterkirche keeps his side alive in this shootout. Fantastic skill. That reverse back stick. Oh, couldn't ask for any better. Yeah, he's a man who's not afraid of the big stage. Well, they'll be hoping that Bakker is not afraid either. As he goes in, he's one-on-one -on -one here. Quick turn. Oh! That is it. The pads and it's gone wide. Shimchik didn't really make the save as much as it hit him. And it level score here in the shootout. Wow, it hits his pad and somehow another just goes wider that left and upright. On, and here comes the man of the evening, Michael Kerper. And it is a stroke. This uh, penalty strike. And Michael Kerper puts it in the back of the goal for the Austrians. 2015 World Cup champion. Dutch are sitting down for now. Max Swearing has the opportunity to pull level here. Swearing. Swearing puts it in the back of the goal. I almost thought we were going to hear the hooter there as he took his time. He waited, he waited, he waited, and he just moved Shimchik to the one side before he put it away on the other. Sudden death, 1-1, one, one, and if it's tie off the six, we'll change order again. again yeah. Bergot goes first for the Netherlands. Bergot. Bergot. Bergot is denied, and it comes off his foot. The Netherlands skipper, Boris Bergot. There's Fabian Unterkirscher. He's denied the first time. He can't be denied the second time. And Fabian Unterkirscher wins it for Austria. Austria retain the title. They are the FIH Indoor Hockey World Cup champions of 2023. As the game ends, 4-4. Austria winning the shootout 3 2. An incredible, incredible match. An incredible experience to be part of.